All right, thank you very much for joining me again. This is Gull Payne back with a quick response video. And this response video is to uh, the Game Shack. And the Game Shack asked, um, what is retro? Like, what do you consider retro? Um, so I haven't got a chance to listen to other people's replies yet, but I thought it was an interesting question because what I would consider retro would be like Atari or, you know, like vector graphics or like even the Nintendo Master System, Super Nintendo sort of thing. Like, but like, anything past that, like the 3D polygons, even like the really early ones, I probably wouldn't consider them retro. It's quite strange if you think about it. Like the sprite based um, graphics, I'd always consider them retro. Like if it was um, like the Legend of Zelda, um, a link to the past or something like that or if it was um, like Super Mario Brothers 3 it's considered them retro but I wouldn't consider like Final Fantasy 7 or Metal Gear Solid 1 retro um, or maybe they are retro I don't, I don't know <laughs> but um, yeah it's funny so I, I kind of think it's um, it's mainly like the sprite based um, stuff that's retro and then anything that's well it's kind of hard to know because if it's like really really early like Virtua Racing um, or like Virtua Fighter 1 or something like that you know those ones where it's like the pol polygons are really basic um, it looks it looks like awful like it doesn't they don't age well at all um, which is ironic because the I think anyway that the sprite based stuff like ages really well like Super Mario World still looks fine to me um, today like whereas you know, some of the really, really early polygon, 3D polygon stuff looks abysmal. Like, um, similarly, like with the the kind of the, the most the most games I would play would be like JRPGs and like something like Chrono Trigger or um, did you, you don't need to do much with them uh, to kind of update them. Like they still look retro. You know, they're still enjoyable, but they kind of have that charm, the sprite charm that um, the 3D polygon stuff doesn't have. So that's what I think anyway. I think anything like PlayStation One. Um, some people consider PlayStation 3 retro now with the PS4 and PS5 out, but um, that's for me anyway. I think like once you're, once you're like into the, um, like not 3D um, sort of games, but then you've got the the games on the PC that were like um, you know the flight simulators and all that, um, or the 3DO. So it's it's kind of hard to tell, but somewhere around like the the end of the. 20th century I think <laughs> when once you come into 21st century I don't think it's retro anymore, but that's part that'll probably change in a while. Um, so that's my answer. Thank you very much, um, Game Shack, for 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 answer, uh, asking that uh, stimulating question. And uh, thanks very much for watching. And I'll see you again soon. Bye.